Got my corn cob pipe. My country gentleman. My friend corn cob piper sent me out um, a another cob two other pipes several samples of uh, tobacco in this I am smoking one of them there samples peanut butter cup I think Reese's should make this stuff I've only been chooching on it for a few minutes trying to get an idea for how it tastes Carving Piper described a method that when I slow myself down and I concentrate on what I'm doing, works really well. Place the pipe in your mouth, I seal my lips closed around the pipe, and I inhale through my nose. Hang on. Now we'll try it. What you do is, you like I said, you seal your lips around the stem, uh, the pipe. Inhale through your nose, and then gently exhale, maybe a little bit out of your mouth and kind of down the stem of the pipe and it helps cool the pipe off a little bit but you get more flavor out of your tobacco doing that I'm not sure why that works maybe because it's coming in through your nose and you're smelling it uh, more You gotta get it burning really good first though. Otherwise that method doesn't really work. It's not a bad tobacco. The peanut butter cup smell, when you like open up the bag or whatnot and you smell it, you get a lot more aroma from it than what I'm getting from smoking it. It's pretty good. All right, Cobb, you're going to have to tell me where you got it at. Show me the can or whatever, or tell me if you bought it in bulk or what. I think I might like to order this. Staring off into space trying to think of what it was I wanted to talk about along with since I'm already got the video going. Oh I mentioned in the previous video that I'll have a box opening of a couple cans of tobacco I ordered. But I also ordered a pipe from Aristocob. I thought while I was making a video about corn cob pipes and talking about corncob piper that uh, I would mention that since they all kind of go together 
Corn Cob. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and whomever, I appreciate y'all watching my videos. Thank you.